I'm making the roll. I'm just trying to get out of the way. Try and stop. Uh, You're rolling? Yeah, the affiliation and socialize, right? Yeah. I'm also doing the same thing. Yeah. Oh, okay. But you know. Um, making the high socialize. Yeah. So, uh. Yeah. Famished gets this kind of sagely look about him, and he goes full on, like, enlightened from old man. Shit. Yeah, from oh the desert. <laughs> In fact, like, it goes from, like, far beyond his, like, normal face, it actually almost, he try he puts on this effort, and you see him sink in, like, he's even more famished, and hungry and starving, and yet his eyes kind of lighten up with wisdom. What little nutrition is in your body gets sacrificed? <laughs> yep. <laughs> I see all. <laughs> oh, about to die though. <laughs> <laughs> That's bad wisdom. Oh. And, oh. He, and he puts a kindly smile on his face as they approach. <laughs> that looks creepy. I don't think he wants to die though. I'm sorry, is anybody creepy. thinking Kill Bill at all? I was thinking like Skeletor. <laughs> 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 you get an extra success and two bonuses. Oh, massage chair. Yeah. If it were Canada, I would make you my wife. Two bonus <laughs> What's up? Did you have a stun? Um, well, I, I kind of had one. Um, let's see. No, I can't really think of anything right now. Yeah. Alright, well, hold I the roll. I need check. Er, yeah. Um, hold the roll in that case. Okay. I was gonna give it a shot. Honestly, she just goes to refill the flask that she has. Very stumbly wise, though. Clearly, she's had way too much to drink. And she's clearly getting more. But is also watching, just slightly. But she takes a nice big swallow. Alright, two points. Gulp, gulp. Ooh, danger sense. No. Yeah. Okay. Oh, so it's not a roll. Okay. Gotcha. Yeah. I don't know how to work. <laughs> what? The book is right there. Yeah. This is the character that I made for him, so he doesn't actually have knowledge of all the things on the character sheet. No, and my yeah. first exalted game. <laughs> oh, <also, laughs> uh, grab the book to read them. A one dot stun is worth two bonus dice. Uh, a two dot stun is worth one success and two bonus dice plus a willpower if you haven't spent any. A three dot stun um, is worth two successes, two bonus dice, and two willpower, regardless of whether or not you have spent any. The overflow disappears, Wayne. End of scene. Danger sense. Um, perception or awareness. Uh, an indefinable six sense warns the character when she's in seven. major or def seven. Uh, seven. <coughs> definite seven. asset in the time of roll. Seven successes. She enjoys a bonus seven. die roll on roll. Die on rolls to attack danger. Yes, I did. Okay. Yes, you enjoy bonus dice on rolls to detect danger. Okay. So, you are asking me if your danger sense applies. It does not. Oh, oh, okay. Okay. Or... Well, I mean... <clears throat> what? 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 Huh? No. Potato! Slut! I... Potato slut? Potato slut. Potato slut! Potatoes can be sluts, did you know that? Anyways. What do you think all those eyes are for? Ripped. I wonder how many things I did you get? Okay. You have one threshold. Seven. Damn. Jesus. <laughs> you have four thresholds. <laughs> the one good roll of that. <laughs> Holy crap. It's not going to be the last one, right? Actually, probably not. That's exactly. Not a roll? <laughs> exactly. Um, four hole. A hole. Okay. Yeah. I'll stop again at the appropriate point so that you can have more of the context of the situation and perhaps stun tomorrow. Okay. Um, I just don't know how to stun a perception very well. That's fair. Yeah. Um, Twist my body <laughs> so my eyes are aligned with the target. <laughs> yeah, but you gotta do it in like You're a not self selfie stance. Stop it. You have to just. <laughs> <clears throat> that would actually, like, that's a modern day perception stun. Think about it, it's three panels of the comic, wherein she like reaches into the purse, she pulls out the compact. Yeah. It's the hand reaching into the purse and pulling out the compact. Yeah. It's the looking into the compact at the target. Stop it, Kyle. And then it's the reading lips. Oh. 
Actually, I've done the same thing with the cell phone. God damn it. Um, anyways. So they approach. Uh, for those of you who already made the manipulation of social I will inform you of what you discover when it happens. Basically, you've made this in preparation, uh, as I stated. Um, one of them steps forward, and you can see now that he is within short range. Uh, very clearly, on his chest, the guild sigil. Wasn't the guy who hired this part of the guild? Nope. nope. I think we actually even no? No, he was just wearing a cloak. We don't know. Yeah. No, we no, don't know. We don't know what he was. Yeah. He could have been. I mean, he's. <coughs> he was just know, wearing a cloak. So that's all we know. The yeah. Hell? yeah. Which also means he could be with the guild. We're really or bad with interviews. I just realized that. That's what could be implies, Kyle. <laughs> it means it could or could not, without going into so many words. Kyle? <laughs> Screw Uh. Afternoon. Afternoon, friends. I am Guild Merchant Katifa. I have come from trading with the Delson tribes to the south, delivering medicine for their uh, plague ridden. Are you friend or foe? Friend is towards tense, clearly. <laughs> <laughs> Two people on horseback behind him, like. Friend. <laughs> I am famished sage from the Gourmet Nomads. Ah, it's a pleasure to meet friends in the desert. We uh, got a bit turned around. This is where the manipulation plus socialized world comes up. Mm. Now, like okay. I said, there's a read intentions action on him and what he wants out of the scene. Okay. <clears throat> would you like to stunt or would you like to roll? I'll just roll. Okay, yeah, go for it. Yes? So as... Would you like to stunt? Yes. Aha! So, I'm just a big oaf. Yes? And, uh, obviously, Famished Sage is our leader who is talking, and the focus of their leader is on Famished Sage predominantly, even though he's warily eyeing the rest of us. And as he warily eyes the rest of us, I just kind of let my face kind of droop. Like I let the intellect fall from my face like an abandoned boulder over a forgotten cliff. <laughs> As clearly I am not intelligent enough to do more than just be hired muscle, menial labor mule, so that they are not aware that I understand their blades, their positioning of their blades, and their hands compared to their blades, to know how ready they are to I'll give you two. I really want to give you one, though, because someone else in your party has already played on this ruse. Uh, uh, the drunk ruse. Yes. Hi. She played drunk. Ah, uh, same, same ruse. That's fair. We're clearly not threats. Yeah, but see, I'm drunk and I'm a woman. So no, no, no. <laughs> Menial labor brutes that. are threats. <laughs> Menial labor brutes are threats. They're just not smart. Yeah. I didn't say I w he was acting like I'm not still a giving you the two points, but I'm telling you. I'm just drunk. Just stupid drunk. I'll spend the willpower on it. Oh, oh, oh. Which gives. What's the answer? Do you need to, though? Do you need to? <laughs> Do I not? You know you're going to get 15 fucking successes. I'm getting so. a willpower point for it. <laughs> yeah, I was like, so yeah, I might as well get more Yeah, I'm holding on. I can't hand Can you hand us the book? Oh. No, I'm gonna look it up on my phone. Yeah. Oh, Fuck you! <laughs> Whoa. Whoa! You gave me like two mm. seconds to respond. That escalated. Quickly. I know, right? Thank you, Greg. <laughs> yep. It de escalated just as quickly. That really almost got out of hand. It was a roller coaster! Ooh. I'm in a glass case. I didn't know what was gonna happen. <laughs> <laughs> I'm gonna go to the house and I'm out of shit! What? How are those emotions coming for you over there? Ah, uh, you know, not good. Alright. That's kind of a roller coaster. Yeah. One automatic success. Oh, it's just one automatic success. Yep. So I have two successes before I roll. Yep. So you can spend one, uh, spend a willpower for an automatic success to increase a single static value, defense, resolve, guile, parry, etc. by one. 
Uh, you can only spend one willpower point per opposing roll, and you must use it before your opponent's player rolls. Mm. Uh, yeah. You use it to reject certain kinds of social influence, and if you have charms, you use it to pay for charms occasionally. They tell you when you need to spend them. Yep. How often do willpower come back? Once per night of good sleep. Oh, yes. Okay. Um, two dice or more stunts. Nice. In two or three dice stunts. Two or three dot stunts. Um, as well in. Uh, <laughs> I Things. Things. Oh! In support, when you uh, undergo peril in support of major or defining intimacy, mm. you gain a little power. Uh, how many successes did you get? Three. You really did all wrong. So you succeeded without a threshold. He's not honest at this point. Okay. Three threshold, like seven. Uh, no, you rolled seven successes. Yeah. So four threshold. Yep. I had four, so that's one threshold. One threshold, okay. Um, turn. What? My turn? I mean, sure, if you want to roll manipulation plus socialize. Totally. So, so uh. uh <laughs> so, my guy and whatnot, he, he's gonna like kind of just hop off the cart and whatnot and kind of wander the donkey. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, one dice not with the donkey, and the environment is the definition of a one dice not, which means you get two on the cart. Saddle, saddle, saddle. Two of them. I like how everyone in your party is like, I'm clearly not paying attention. Yeah. <laughs> and I'm like, I'm actually not paying attention. <laughs> uh, two. I have a reason to so, no. roll on the dice. Just two. Three. Oh. Just two. Yeah. Okay. Eight and a nine. Which may or may not be yeah. worth one. Yeah. True. Yeah. It was difficulty three. Yeah. Yay! How many? So you're staring at them directly as you're watering the donkey. Like, mm. this is interesting. <laughs> <laughs> do you, please right. tell me you do with that grip. I got at least the threshold. Mm -hmm. No, you got two. Oh, you got two. That's my dice. Oh, okay, never mind. So, no, you, he's clearly just a little bit turned around, it's fine. Um, <laughs> it's gonna go. Of course he's just... Don't get it! Yeah, it's easy to do, like, all the dunes look the same. <laughs> Fuck, man. Unless there's worms in them. Um, the... That's Oh, God. Oh, right, so, Guild Merchant Katifa. Benson's just a little bit turned around. To all of the rest of you, he's... Being euphemistic, not necessarily honest. Uh, one threshold success. Being euphemistic, not necessarily honest. One threshold success. Or like, maybe closer to lost? <laughs> More like definitely lost and probably in need of supplies. Uh, Helpful. <laughs> Stick in the ass. <clears throat> what? Sorry, that's, that happens when Satan comes in. <laughs> so, uh, mine was on the guards. Yeah. I was read intentions. Their intent is to protect Katifa. But they're not. Their 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 intent is guardian, not unwanted violence, not prompt. Like, they don't look like they want to provoke violence. Yes, their motivation for the scene is to protect Katifa. I'm sorry, the way you pronounced it, like, earlier, it sounded like Katifa. And now we have it in my head all the time. Katifa? Katifa. Nice. Kitty sorry. Kitty I'm not sorry. <clears throat> I'm not sorry. I try. 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 Um, Katifa. Yes, so if you could point the way to... Paragon? I point north. Hmm. Uh, <laughs> Do you know which way is north? <laughs> yeah! No. <laughs> I point the way behind us. Oh. That way. Uh, which I'm assuming is north, because my guy knows that the oasis is two days travel south. <laughs> no. I mean, but good assumption. <laughs> Hear that, comrades? We're so close. 
<laughs> Speaking of, I would hate to be trouble. We are humble guild merchants who have given up most of our products. I uh, traded the Del Sol to the south. Might we trade supplies? I have only silver to offer, but I would be more than happy for even just some water to get us through the day and a half, depending on. Or even just a half day to the savannah when we can hunt. So to hunt things that don't have a poison in the spine, some deadly things. Uh, yes, that would be a problem if you don't know how to do with them. Uh, mm. I think we can. Well, yeah, the cat guy too. But uh, if there is any, it doesn't look like it. You gotta watch out for worms, though. This isn't tremors. <laughs> <laughs> There's more worms? <laughs> or dune. Uh, or dune, yeah. <laughs> Specifically Spice. dune. Uh, I think we can let go of one of our barrels. Walk over and waste one. <laughs> I greatly appreciate the sacrifice. He pulls out like a couple of silver coins. <clears throat> That's more than a barrel of water's worth. <laughs> 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 um, cut that! Cut one of those in half, and that's what you paid for it. <laughs> like, it, it's not intended to be an intimidation grunt. Like, like a, it was his version of like. <laughs> but he's freaking you! <laughs> Ignore him. What? I can't tell what noise that is. He flicks them towards one of you, so whoever catches them. Yeah, I'll just catch him. Okay. Yes. The cart is like mostly empty. You can tell that they actually do still have some dry food, but there are no more barrels. Do they have any dried meats? No. They have hard tech. Set the barrel down. Peek back around. Mm. Hey, famous Shage. Yeah. There's no way in hell in good conscience we can let them eat hard tack. Mm. I'll give them some, uh I cut up an extra side of the uh the haunch. I give them some of that my uh survival food too. Alright. Oh the uh goats. Yep. Ooh, those are good. Certainly there's I appreciate the gesture, but with the water, we will be fine with the hard tack. <laughs> you think hard tack's food? <laughs> I toss the haunch. And you've more than paid for it. One of the cards. I thank you. I appreciate the generosity. 